My name is Einat Bronstein. Um, I, am, I live in Israel. I am originally from Israel, but I live many years in the United States. And um, I have been an IFS therapist since the early 1990s. So pretty much around 30 years. I've been in private practice. I have um, been also um, a teacher for many years. I taught um, in Tel Aviv University, couple therapy and family therapy. And I have been teaching IFS in Israel and throughout the world for many years. I am an IFS um, certified supervisor and a solo lead trainer for um, international IFS trainings for IFS Institute. So IFS in everyday life seems very natural and organic for me. Um, when I introduce myself and I say, and I talk about me and IFS, I don't really say I work with IFS for 30 years. I say I live with IFS for 30 years because IFS is not just a psychological model or a set of techniques that we use in a therapy room and then close the door and go home. It really is a perspective about life. It's a lens through which I understand myself and others and the relationships that I have with people and that people have with each other. So it's really a perspective and a map to understand ourselves and to understand what's going on in our lives and with other people's lives. So offering this kind of a course, this kind of a class is really making something um, wonderful and useful, accessible to everyone. Because up until now, all IFS programs have been pretty much geared towards professionals, mental health professionals who learned it in order to use it in their work with people and help their clients heal, uh, and improve their lives and get better. But really, it makes so much sense to take it out of the therapy room and just offer it to people for everyday life, for their own experience of themselves, in their relationship with their spouses, in their relationship with their children, with their parents, with their friends, colleagues, neighbors, communities, um, because it is so helpful in every human relationship. So I am delighted, it's been a dream of mine, to offer IFS outside of the therapy setting and outside of treatment setting, just for everyday life. So for therapists who have already been trained in IFS, um, this can be very helpful in, in different ways. Uh, first of all, the IFS perspective is so rich and can be used in so many different ways that you're never done learning it. Even if you've been to a, a training level one, level two, as a therapist, as a professional, there's still so much more to learn. And even things you've heard already, when you hear them with different ears in a different setting, said a little bit differently, they clear up, they all of a sudden make sense in a different way. And, you know, our understanding always seems to expand and get deeper. The more we hear, the more we are exposed to this. So that's the first thing that even if you will hear things that you think you already heard or know, you are different now than you were several months ago, a year ago, two years ago. So you're going to hear it differently. And it's when you hear something the second, third, fourth time, it meets you in a different way than it did the first, second time. The other thing is when we learn it as therapists, we learn it as professionals, many times we are a bit limited in just thinking how to apply it to our clients, how to use it in the therapy room, in therapy session, in this therapeutic setting. Here, we're going to really work with, with the IFS concepts and, and perspective to see how we can just use it for ourselves and use it in the relationship that we are, you know, connected with every day. So our exercises, our activities, our practices are going to be geared not to how a therapist is offering and applying it in, in therapy, but it's going to be mostly geared to how I can take it 
as an individual, as just a person into my life, into my daily life. So it's a different spin. It's a different way of looking um, at the IFS knowledge. IFS and relationships is a, just a beautiful topic because all our lives we are in a relationship. You know, we start off in a relationship. We're born, you know, we grow up in a family. We have parents, grandparents, siblings. So relationship is what human beings do all the time. And in IFS, we're looking at the relationship that we have with others in our lives as a reflection of the relationship we have inside of ourselves. So many times the, re the relationship we're able to have with people outside of us, no matter who they are, relatives, spouses, partners, children, are limited by the relationship that we have inside of us. Um, and they are very much impacted by the internal relationship between our different parts, the different elements inside of us. So doing this work internally gives us tremendous amount of insight about the relationship we have with others and allows us to make desirable changes in the relationship that we have with others. It allows us to understand the other person. It allows us to understand deeply what happens to us with the other person, why we have problems, challenges, conflicts, or why we get along so well and we love and we connect so well. And so it gives us an ability to understand deeply what is going on for us in relationships and how to improve and heal and correct things that need to be corrected. So IFS and parenting is, you know, could be under the big umbrella of IFS and relationship, but it is such an important element in our lives that we decided to dedicate a whole class just to this parenting. So from the IFS perspective, parenting has many layers to it because the first thing that happened to us when we just started our life is we experienced parenting as consumer. We received parenting from whomever was our parents. And we then learn over the years how to parent ourselves because kids need to learn how to parent themselves. You need to know how to behave. You need to be to know how to be safe. You need to learn how to understand the environment, how to behave in school or in the neighborhood or at home. So we learn to do this self-governing or self-parenting. And then many of us end up being parents to our own children, to godchildren, to relative children. So our way of parenting is again, very much impacted by the parenting we received growing up and by the internal parenting that we're able to give ourselves. So we will be looking at all these dimensions of parenting, internal parenting of ourselves, people who provided parenting for us and how that impacted us, people that we are now providing parenting for, or people that still now as adults are providing parenting for us. So we will look at all the dimensions of parenting, uh, which can be, again, very enlightening and very helpful um, in many aspects of our lives. So every class, every topic of the six topics that we've mentioned is going to be divided into two days. And we will have four hours in each day. So we'll start with this topic, you know, four hours in one day and four hours in the next day. So each topic will get eight hours in total, which is like a full day if we were doing one day. And we're going to have a combination of some teaching that I will be talking and teaching theory and a lot of experiential. We will have an experiential exercise um, that you will do either as a large group. We will have the uh, group divided into small groups of three or four people or maybe just dyads to experience some things and explore some things in the more intimate, um, personal way. And many of the times also, I will have a session with one of the participants just to demonstrate how those things work and how we can really relate to ourselves or to others uh, through the IFS way and the IFS uh, format. 
So um, there will be kind of a demonstration of a session or exercises and experiences that you will have along with some theory teaching. So it's going to be a pretty interesting, diverse, uh, versatile uh, eight hours of learning over these two days. I have been blessed by IFS in my life. I met IFS um, early on. I was in my early 30s. I was a fairly young wife, very young mother, and pretty young in my profession. And having IFS in my life has impacted every aspect of my life, my marriage, my parenting, my family, of course, my work. And it has been nothing but good, nothing but gifts. It allowed me to really be um, a better wife, a better parent, a better friend, a better daughter and sister, uh, and I think a better therapist as well. It has really allowed me to connect to myself and to connect to other people in very meaningful, deep, and helpful ways, helpful for them and helpful for me. So I think that because it is such a deep and such a profound um, model, and because it is so positive and humanistic and so much highlighting the, 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 uh, the energy and the healing capacity and the strength of the person, it is uh, a blessing to have in your life. And so I believe with all my heart that everyone who will participate in this course will benefit greatly and the people in your life will benefit greatly. And these are benefits that last a lifetime. It's not just in the first few weeks or a few months after you've been in the class. This goes really deep and really becomes part of you and who you are and stays with you for a lifetime. So I'm inviting you and I hope you will join us in this journey.